Hello everyone. So today I am working on converting this evaluation edition of Windows Server 2022 to the full version. Okay, so here I have an installation can see the countdown of the evaluation out of 180 days um, it's now left for 127 days okay so I want to convert this um, evaluation edition of Windows Server 2022 on this server to the full version um, and to do that um, first I'll call up PowerShell run PowerShell as administrator so next I'll run this DS DISM command first of all I want to run the DSI command to know that will tell us the um, current edition of DISM space slash online space slash get Okay, so here it is. The current edition is server standard evaluation. Okay, by running the command dism space slash online space slash get current edition, um, then that results to this. Okay, so next, um, the target edition. Now we target editions um, just to tell us um, the editions that this this current installation can be upgraded to. So enter to that. Okay, so here it says I can only upgrade to standard and server standard and server data center. I have a retail license for Starver server standard for standard edition so I will upgrade to standard. Okay, so at this point um I'll have to enter my product key. So here is the product key. Um, this is not. Um, this is a generic standard product key, and then uh, at the end, put space slash accept ULA. Accept ULA is accept end user license agreement. So with that, and then you hit the enter button. Wait for a moment. Now what is it doing? Okay. So this image cannot upgrade to the edition of Windows that was specified. The upgrade cannot proceed. Run get to see the upgrade. Oh, I think I missed up something. Okay, yeah, I said uh, standard get set standard set edition standard. Okay, so I've seen the, the reason for this error and um, 
set standard this uh, set edition edition is not just standard but server standard so we're going to correct that right away So that's it, set standard and enter. What is it doing right now? Okay, so the process has started, process of converting the evaluation edition to the retail or to the full edition. So yeah, you see um, it's doing all of that. This might take a pretty while, so I'm going to pause for a while and then come back at the end of the upgrade. Alright, so the process has completed and it requires a restarting to finish up. So do you want to restart now, sir? Yes. Okay, so the computer has um, booted up. Um, it did a lot of um, adding features and cleaning up. Now it's completely um, booted up. You can see the the watermark that used to be at the right bottom corner um, is no longer there. And check for further proofs. Alright, so you see now I have Windows Server 2022 standard, no longer standard evaluation. So from here I can go ahead and impute my my full license. Um, that's the authentic one. Okay, so you can see as a Windows is not activated. Good. Okay, so that's our so that's that. Thank you.